Now America has a new and dangerous quarry species this year, the zombie. Of course, they don't exist. Or do they? Okay, so you know how we ask you to send in your pics? It all starts right here in the swamps of Louisiana. Last year, a local hunter claimed he found his trail cam smashed. He retrieved the card from it and found this picture. Fake or not, it has helped fuel a craze for zombie target shooting. It's not just one company riding this bandwagon. There are loads offering cartridges, knives, chainsaws, chainsaws. Even brand giant Hornady has brought out a zombie bullet. The clue is it has a green tip. These targets with the weeping jammy goo are selling like hot cakes and are coming in all shapes and politically incorrect sizes. It's a five billion dollar industry between video games and movies, TV shows, you know there's a new movie coming out, World War Z with Brad Pitt, and it's just a growing industry and we're just getting a lot of great feedback because, you know, because zombies are such a huge thing. You know they got zombie ammunition, zombie firearms, you know throughout the whole show there's countless products about people we're working with that want to co-brand with us because, you know, if you have this zombie gun, you need some, you need some zombies to shoot. Also protecting the American public from zombie attack are a range of special shotgun cartridges being advertised in this film. They come in a variety of gauges, 410, 20 bore, but they are blanks and intended, say the manufacturers, for recreational use. Hmm, whatever that means. This round produces a tremendous amount of noise, a huge muzzle flash, theatrical almost in its effect. And again, it's recreational. Um, it has, it, it's not for accuracy where you're putting holes in a target. It's, it's just for having fun with firearms if you do it safely. So what if you accidentally mix these cartridges with real cartridges? Not recommended by, by any. This, this is real bullets uh, or real ammunition. It, it's a real threat. It's not intended to shoot at people. Uh, if, if you're going to shoot at a zombie target or something along those lines, fine. All rules of firearm safety apply. If you got a real gun, it's a real threat, so you have to treat it accordingly. So, no, this is not a recreational force-on-force -force type of uh, paintball load, not by any means. Oh, my God. The question remains, why are American shooters so keen on shooting zombies? Is it because they are human-like targets but don't come with the shame and guilt people feel when they shoot more human, human targets? Some people might say that the reason we chose a zombie because you're supposed to shoot zombies. You know, zombies coming after you, you got to, you know, destroy the undead is our tagline. And that's kind of what we wanted to do. Or you're not shooting a human target, you're shooting the undead target. So here you are, zombie targets coming to a graveyard near you.